G'day guys, the Comic Book Noob here, and today I thought I'd do a little series roundup on the Daphne Byrne series. Now, this collects issues one through the six. This was uh, put out by DC Black Label, Hill House Comics. Uh, and I thought I'd just do a little series roundup, because the series is finished. Uh, and I just, I thought I'd just go over the book, uh, tell you my thoughts on it, and show you a little bit of the artwork, things like that. So uh, stick around guys, and uh, we'll go through the Daphne Byrne series. Alright guys, then we're back, the comic book noob here, doing a series recap, review, overview, and um, whatever you want to call it, I guess, of Daphne Byrne. So, if you're new to the channel, guys, remember to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and all right, let's get into it. So, Daphne Byrne, uh, six issues, put out, like I said, DC Black Label, Hill House Comics. Uh, it follows the story of Daphne Byrne, who is, uh, she's, like a, she's, she's like a teenage girl, I think. I, I don't know her exact age. Um, so her, her father has died, she starts seeing this, this, uh, entity, a, a boy that's, that's about her age as well. She's got a bit of a weird relationship with that entity. Um, her mum, uh, still wants to connect and talk with her, her deceased husband. She's kind of roped into these, uh, this group of people that can, uh, can, um, communicate with the dead. So she's been roped into that. She's paying all sorts of money. Daphne's sort of realised that it's all full of bullshit. She tries to sort of unravel it a few times so that a mum can see. But a mum's like so heavily invested in, you know, that it's real, that she just doesn't believe it, even when the smoke and mirrors have been like, you know, shown right in front of her. So it turns out that the uh, the people that uh, are communicating with the dead and you know doing this whole smoke and mirrors things they're like they're like a sort of satanistic sort of cult as well and that sort of becomes more sort of prevalent towards you know the the end of the series uh and it's yeah i mean it's it's got some twists and turns and it's not bad it's uh, i don't, i don't want to go too much into it so i don't want to spoil it for you but that's yeah that's pretty much how it goes with that group of people, I suppose, in the book. So, it, it's it's not a bad book. It's not, it's not brilliant. It's not mind-blowing. It's a good concept. It was a good enough story to keep me collecting the entire six-issue run. Uh, one thing I, I... I won't say too much about the book because it's sort of... Towards the end, it's, it starts making more sense. Uh, there's, there's, some, there's some things that happen too that I don't want to spoil as well. As it gets pretty hectic at, at points in the book. Um, but I will say, the the series, collecting it as, you know, month by month as it came out, and then the whole stoppage in comics as it happened, it, it lost a bit of momentum. So I do think it'd be better read in a, if you ended up getting the whole six issues at your LCS or on eBay or wherever. It'd be better off reading them, you know, in in one sitting or two sittings. It'd be, you know, best to get the book read in sort of, you know, as little as time as you can possibly do it. So just the bit, as, you know, the weight just pulled a bit of momentum from the book and it's, it's a fairly... Fairly slow happening book. I, I don't think there's a lot. It, issue two or three, there wasn't a lot that happened. So, yeah, momentum kind of died a little bit. Overall, I'd give it probably a three out of five. I mean, yeah. I mean, I'm not going to tell you to go out and buy it, but I'm not going to tell you not to buy it either. It's, yeah, but it's not a bad book. So I'll just show you a bit of the artwork from, from issue one. This, uh, this sort of... Uh, the artwork's pretty cool, but I do feel in some parts the art does let it down. It's more sort of a close-up sort of thing. Um, I mean, like, that's 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 not bad. That's, that's pretty cool. Um, not, nice artwork there. But then I'll just find a page. Yeah, like like here. It looks... Yeah, just, I mean, she just looks 
weird. Um, I mean, the colouring's done quite well. The art is good, but yeah, like I said, it just um, there's just points in the book where it doesn't, you know, it just doesn't um, appeal. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, the art is fine, but yeah, like I said, I won't repeat myself too much, but yeah, I mean, you get some cool stuff like that. It's 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 not a bad book. It's pretty cool. And I'll just show you, um, I've never seen, I've, this This book came damaged. I've never seen, like this, like that, that's, that's, that's ink, that's, that, 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 this cover is perfect. I just wanted to show you this because I've, n I've never seen, uh, like a damaged book like this. You can see there, like that sort of, it's like it's came out of the press or the, the book's been, you know, just folded and ripped sort of as the page has gone in to get, you know, stapled together. It's, yeah, I mean, that, that's that's really weird, I think. And you can see some of the artwork there. I mean, that is, uh, that's terrible. That's like, <laughs> you know what I mean? So some of that artwork is what I'm talking about where it lets it down. Um, but yeah, that's it, guys. That's uh, that's pretty much the, the series rundown on, on Daphne Byrne. I enjoyed it. I didn't love it, but I didn't hate it. So I'm gonna say, if you're confused about it, if, if you're on the fence about picking it up, you might have to uh, chuck the old Harvey Dent two-face flip a coin and maybe let that decide. But yeah, I think the trade, there's a trade coming out in the next few months, so keep your eye out for it. Um, and if you're interested in it, pick it up. If you're not, leave it. That's it for me, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Remember to hit that like button and hit the subscribe if you're not already. Thanks for watching the video guys, I'll see you next video.